Praise the Lord. Hallelujah, family. I am happy to be with you all again in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. If this is your very first time of seeing me or coming across my channel, you're welcome. God bless you. God increase you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Do not forget to like and subscribe to this channel if you're new. And to my returning subscribers, thank you so very much for always stopping by. God bless you. God increase you in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. My prayer for you all this day is may this one not pass you by as the light of God's countenance and shine over you and all that concerns you in this season of your life. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord God. Hallelujah. There is someone close to you that they need your prayers. They feel like as a result of what they did to you, um, they are blaming themselves for what they are going through now. Like they wish they did not treat you badly. They wish they did not give you the worst treatments because they feel like they are living in the consequence of their actions towards you. And it's killing them, the guilt of their actions, you know, the guilt inside of them. Even though you have forgiven them, but they, they just have this feeling inside of them of how bad they treated you and it's making them feel guilty and it's killing them. You know how guilt can, you know, it, I, I always say guilt is a great destroyer. It can kill someone. It can put someone in a place of depression. And once someone is found in a place of depression, it, it, it takes only God to bring them out of depression. Because depression leads you to, to make the worst decisions. Hallelujah. So someone close to you that did, did not treat you well. They wish they did better. You know, a lot of people may give you bad treatments because they have not seen your future. Hallelujah. And to the one who owns you, to the one who created you, just looking at them and smiling. Hallelujah. If only they knew. That this is who you will become. If this, if only they knew that this is how your life would turn out. They would have treated you better. They would have done better. And now the guilt of their action is killing them. It's killing them. They feel so guilty. So right now, what you need to do is to give them that assurance. You know, some people may not accept it. Even when you go close to them, they'll make you feel like that's not the reason why they are the way they are. But you just need to love them and make them understand that you have forgive, forgiven them from a genuine place. Because it is actually the kind of heart that you have that makes God to bring you or give you the kind of things that you have now. Because God has tested your heart. God has tested your heart and he has seen. So you just need to reassure them, make them understand that. You don't, you are not angry with them and they should not feel like you are forgiving them from a genuine place. Hallelujah. I pray for someone that is watching me right now in the name of Jesus. That God will grant you the grace that you need to help this person bring them out of that place of depression. Bring them out of that place of condemnation. And the love of God envelop you in Jesus mighty name. Amen. I pray for wisdom and strength. God bless you. God increase you. I love you all. You all are special. Amen.